Knock, knock, it's Knuckles. Hello, everyone, and welcome to an this thing. This is Sonic the Hedgehog Blasting Adventure, a remake of Sonic 3D Blast 5, Sonic Adventure 7, and Sonic Adventure 8, all bootlegs. And someone decided to re remake it for PC. If you want to try this out, there's going to be a link to the Game Jolt page down below. Um, seems like the controls are very easy enough, you know, jump with Z, X to do whatever action it is for Sonic, it's the ends of shield for Tails is flying, down Z for spin dash. We're going to play a Sonic a little bit and see what this is all about. Hopefully it's a little bit better, so uh, we can only see. We have the 8-bit Green Hill. Good so far. Oh my gosh, what is this? No, no, this is not the same game I played. Okay, this is definitely not the same game I played. This must have been one of the other games. But... Okay, first off, Sonic is fast. Like, that's insane how fast he's moving. It's also insane how well he's controlling. Ow. How well does the Insta Shield work? Okay, well, I'm too scared to try out the Insta Shield. Oh, precision platforming! Oh, I could have tried it on him. Or it. Oh, there we go. It works really well. Wow, that's actually really cool. Oh, oh! Wow. Um, I'm impressed. I mean, that was an unusually short level, but I'm gonna give it that. It was actually entertaining. Oh no, the flashbacks are here already. Oh, whoops. But the thing is, is that since I have the Insta Shield, a lot of the enemies are gonna be easy to dispose of. The platforming, on the other hand, is gonna be tough. At least I can get my uh, my rings back. And this actually looks really good. Okay, whoever remade this, um. I mean, the music's still grating as you... Not... Actually, no, even the music's pleasant. I am actually taken back by the quality of this. Sure, it's not great. I mean, it could really use uh, some controller support. That'd be amazing. But look at that. I mean, Sonic moves a little too fast for how, for how small this is, but still... Okay, I gotta stop doing that. Oh boy, Pre precision platforming, and I'm not a fan of it. Sonic does not ever have to do precision platforming. Oh my. I get really tense in platforming since you. Oops. <laughs> oh, and it puts me right back at the. Ow! Right back into a trap. Whoa. That almost completely. That almost worked. This is honestly kind of cool. I mean, I hate platforming with keyboard controls, but that's only because I'm so used to a controller. You know, this is what I'm used to. But even... Even aside from the fact that I'm going way too fast, like, I feel like Sonic could be slowed down a little bit. I know it's like, oh, oh, Sonic has to slow down. Well, yeah, I mean... Sh sure, being fast is his gimmick, but at when it's at the... Um, when you sacrifice game quality for, uh, or platforming quality for speed, that's when it's like, maybe you can take, maybe you can slow him down a bit. Oh, dang it! I'm screwing up. It's actually my fault. That, on the other hand. Okay, that one was actually my fault. I kept going. It, am... Is it weird if I say that even though I am, like, playing, like, garbage because I find them to be a little... Yeah, you know what? We are gonna continue. Screw that. I'm not I'm not done with this. I mean, he's a little too fast for my liking, especially for how much visibility I get. 
not really visibility on enemies, because that's covered. Like, my visibility of the enemies, Sonic, is just the right size for this kind of uh, aspect ratio. I think it's the, uh, because of how fast I'm moving, the visibility of what's coming up can, can probably be fixed. Oh, God, come on. And the music's a little repetitive. And it's not even from the fact that I've been spending all of my time here, it's just the fact that it loops it doesn't it doesn't loop very well. I'm gonna take this slowly. I wish I had controller support. That'd probably make this go a lot better. Okay, I'm playing with my controller now. It's like if I had controller support this entire time, I'm gonna be angry. Like, if I had controller support in this this whole time, like, that would have made me very upset. Because... I... Okay, the knockback is really gonna ruin it for me. Like, my issue is just all the, um... The precision platforming. And I guess the knockback in this area. Okay, I didn't want to get hit. It's like, if I got hit, that, that would have been it. I would have been PO'd the entire time. No! Okay. So if I'm a bit quiet here, I'm just trying to, like, focus. Oh, there's an invisible ceiling up there. I actually made it! Okay, how did that happen? Get a one up, and that's it. I've seen the first level of Sonic Adventure 7. I, I finally got to see the whole level, and that would have been impossible. <laughs> Sonic 3? Select. Oh my god! Oh, okay. I think that's one knock I'll have to give to these. Oh, it's a Game Boy or Game Gear sound effects. My apologies. I, I didn't mean Game Boy. I, I clearly. Wham. Okay, let's keep going. Oh, come on. I do like that it just it just keeps the music going. Sometimes when you go through a level, you just hear like the beginning parts over and over again, especially on a difficult level. Good God, are you kidding me? Bottomless play. Wow. Okay, maybe I'm not having. Maybe I'm not having as much fun as I should be. I mean, it's interesting. It's just you move way too fast and when you try to slow down you don't move fast enough that's the issue that I'm finding here I was screwed out of that one like I hate the fact that like I'm so concerned with how fast I'm going that I'm gonna miss the platform by a huge chunk okay there we go this game has crap physics Okay. No. It's the stupid knockback that's going to get me killed. Okay, not all the visibility is good. Not all of it is, so... I mean, look at that. I am, I'm like... Who would do... Who would, who would intentionally want to do uh, precision platforming with... So God. Okay, there we go. And then we just hit hit that. We're good. So if I play like garbage, I don't really play games on keyboard. Really, more precision. Is that where the difficulty comes from? Like I legitimately 
Okay. Because you slide so much. Okay. And then if you fall through that... Wow! And have to start all the way at the beginning. Oh my gosh! Uh, okay, I was saved from that one. I don't get the whole point of having to... I mean, it controls better than any of the bootlegs. I actually haven't played the other two bootlegs, but... So far, it controls so much better, but it's still way too fast. Okay, so I didn't really have to go for that full run. I just needed a little bit. I don't need the, the rings. Lower? That's scary. Okay. Actually, if I just tap... Oh, God! And there's no collision on that, so... I mean, the only collision is if I hit it! Are you kidding me?! Oh, no. I don't want to do this again. You know what? I'm not going to continue doing this. It's way too slippery for what I like in a Sonic game. Especially fan games. So... There you go. That's... I, I can't believe I, I'm actually seeing a remake of three bootleg games put into one. But there you go. If you want to try out this game for yourself, there will be a link in the description down below. Um, I will say this. The first two levels are a lot better than, I'm assuming, what their bootleg counterparts are. Or the original counterparts. The third level, no, I am i don't like it. You move way too fast, the knockback is horrible. So, I mean, you're always at the mercy of the game's mechanics. There's never really a, if you hit something, you know you're safe, like other Sonic games, because they don't throw you in situations where precision platforming is the one thing you have to do all the time. And that's been my problem with these. Especially the last two levels, you know. That's been my problems with the two levels that we just went through. Uh, the first one wasn't that bad. It was actually over much faster than I expected, so um, there you go. Uh, if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up if you want to try this out for yourself. Again, link in the description below. I don't know how many times I said that. It's probably like the third time. Oh, well, who will? Oh, well, who will? Oh, well, who cares? That's what I meant. If you want to see more content that I produce, feel free to click subscribe and join the Nux Club. Don't forget to also click the bell icon so you can get a notification for every single time I upload, stream, or post something in the community tab here on YouTube. However, if you want interaction outside of YouTube, my Discord server, my Twitter page, and my Amino page will all be linked in the description down below. With that said, I hope you all enjoyed this video, and until next time, thanks for watching. Have a wonderful and safe day, and I'll see you in the next one.